What's up people, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Sanjir and today I'm going to show you a utility product. I play badminton a lot and that is the sport I do like a lot. Um, I play say two hours a day and five times a week. So that's a lot of badminton. And the shoes which I was using previously were these ones of Yonex. They lasted for around a year and they just gave up the durability and they are now torn from various sides. I'll just show it to you. You can see it's already torn from this side and they are not in a good condition right now but the sole is still in a good intact condition but the upper part is just coming out. I'll show you the other pair as well. If you can see from the toe region yeah, that's all torn. From the toe region, it's gone. So these ones lasted for one year. I played a lot wearing these shoes, but that's it, it's done. So I ordered a new one, and this one is of ASICS. The model name is Code Control FF2. I'm gonna unbox this and show it to you, and also gonna review them. So if you are new to my channel, I'll suggest you to subscribe my channel because there are a lot of useful videos which will help you a lot. Let's march on further, unbox this first. So these ones are of ASICS. Hope you can read it. Code Control FF2 Badminton Shoes. The color is Deep Ocean, Oblique Amber and the shoe size is UK10. And um, the unit price of the shoe is 8034 IGST is 964 bucks because they are coming from Vietnam. The final price of this product is 899 that is 9000 I got a discount of 200 and I got it at 8799 I got it from... Uh, so these ones are coming from an online store for sports known as Achiever. I'm going to provide you the link. In the description, their website is also mentioned in here, is Achiever.in. So these aren't coming from Amazon or Flipkart, but coming from Achiever. And the packing is pretty normal, there is nothing fancy about the packing. Just the shoebox inside and they are plastic wrapper on it. Let's unbox it. Don't worry if there is anything damaged, I'm 100% sure that they're gonna replace it if there is any fault to the product. Okay, here is the ASICS box and this one is not stinking. Box looks in a pretty good condition. It looks like a recycled box. And here is the label which I'm gonna read and show it to you. Imported and marketed by ASICS India. And um, the address is of New Delhi. Commodity footwear price is ten thousand nine hundred and ninety-nine. US eleven means UK ten. Manufactured in Vietnam. Okay, the price varies on a lot of sites. On Flipkart and Amazon, this is priced really expensive. It priced eleven thousand. I also checked out other websites. The price was nowhere close to the price I've got it. They were all about 9500 to 10,000. So on Achiever I got it at the cheapest price. Here it is. The color is amber. We got the 
in voice. Shift through blue dot. Let me keep the box aside. The look is pretty nice. I hope that they are sturdy as well. And definitely they should last for at least one and a one and a half year because they aren't cheap, they are expensive, they are professional grade shoes. These ones are of 9k Indian rupees. And it's a rubber here. This is the ASICS famous ASICS famous gel system. Let's check the tags. To confirm the genuinity of this product. Okay, the color is deep portion or you can also call it amber price is mentioned article description is mentioned country of origin is Vietnam imported on May 2022 okie dokie so this is January 2023 so six months already old but not used These are my first ASIC shoes. I generally do use Yonex, but um, this time I switched to ASICs because I was pretty disappointed with the last Yonex shoe. The design is pretty cool and pretty attractive. The outer sole, the upper sole material is, the upper material rather is of rubber. I look for numerous videos on YouTube before buying this, but there was not even one proper video for this model. Code control FF2. I'm now gonna wear it and also show you. Let me show you inside if it's possible to remove the inner sole. The quality of lace seems pretty sturdy. Yeah, the quality of lace is pretty good. I really like this uh, design here. Looks pretty attractive. This one's just like a checkerboard design. In India, we have only this color available right now i searched on many websites but this was the only color available for this model otherwise there are also few other colors available for this code control ff2 the one that particularly it's very eye-catching is black and red if you get that black and red it's very nice let's see the tongue tongue is definitely softer let me compare my previous shoes as well so we have an idea on it these ones are of yonex yeah the tongue of yonex is also pretty soft and the laces of Yonex are thicker and this ones are thinner. The size is always very important to check it before you wear it. It's 28.5 centimeter UK 10 
Euro 45 US 11 oh it's gone here but this one if you can see it it was UK 10 it is mentioned on both the shoes both on both the pairs just gonna remove this and show it to you ASICS confirm the genuinity you can also see inside is uh, the code here the shoe code is here so that confirms the genuinity this is of ASICS and the stitching inside looks pretty much intact Let me remove the inner sole of Yonex. Let's see after the usage. This is the inner of Yonex, and this is of ASICS. Hmm. Not much of a difference. These ones are used, so it's pretty much done, and these ones are brand new. The material is different, the design is also different. Okay, no branding on these ones, branding on this one. And that's the way the Yonex looks from inside. So I'm wearing them and the jeans is pretty much high on my shoe. and. Um, I hope you can see it properly and these ones are snug fit they are very comfortable but they are also very snuggy so they are not giving any room at all they are not at all loose from anywhere they are giving me a perfect fit for my shoe size that is size 10 they are not very heavy they are neither very light as well. They are balanced shoes. Let me do some upper toe movement. You can see upper toe. And let me bounce on my heels. On my heels. Because your entire ankle comes in contact with the ground when you are playing badminton. The movements are pretty much important there are swift movements in this game and there can be jerk on the knees so I'll always advise you to buy high-end quality shoes rather buying cheap ones which are priced somewhere around 30 US dollars 2400 Indian rupees they are gonna give you a lot of pain in your knees not initially but once you play for six months or more so Instead of buying a very expensive racket to begin with, I'll advise you to buy a professional advanced level shoes that will protect your legs. And um, certainly you should not wear it on outdoor cement courts while playing in a society court. I'll advise you to play on a professional badminton indoor club court only. So this is the way they look on my feet. The fitting is excellent. And um, if you're having wide feet, then I'll suggest you to avoid this model because I do not have wide feet. My feet are pretty much medium to thin, but not at all on a wider side. So if you're having a wide feet, these 
may not be comfortable for you. So, so far as rating goes for the shoe, price for the looks and quality and everything available on various platforms around 10k but I got it at 87.99 on Achiever still I find the prices on a higher side decided by ASICS for this code control FF2 this should have been priced somewhere around 6500 to 7000 Indian rupees in my opinion because I have worn a lot of sports shoes and um, of a lot of different brands so the price should have been somewhere between 6500 to 7000 INR for the shoe so the price I'm just gonna rate it as 7 out of 10 for fitting fitting is absolutely excellent for the shoe I'm surely gonna rate it 10 out of 10 for me it's perfect fit for comfort I'm gonna play it for a couple of sessions then only gonna let you know in the comment section how about the comfort right now the comfort is pretty good but once I play it twice or thrice on the coat I'm gonna specify the comfort in the comment section at the moment the comfort I'm gonna rate it 8 out of 10 looks it looks pretty much dope definitely 9 out of 10 so this was my complete review for this ASICS Code Control FF2 shoe. If you got further queries, you can ask me in the comment section and um, I'll try to respond to you as quickly as possible. Now do not forget to subscribe my channel and hit that like button if you like my today's video. Have a good day. I'm gonna sign off now. Bye bye.